you guys said skip had something to say skip oh my god uh, let's see all right skip what you gotta say all right he, he has a bunch of he has a lot of takes skip got a lot of takes tonight okay all right where do we start i guess he only has wait this is 22 hours ago remember when greg popovich said about tim duncan when timmy walks out that door i'll be right behind him what what's your point here okay all right so he changed his mind just like you should have walked away from television old man all right let's see 17 minutes ago when we came alive on offense tonight versus scootless portland i don't know why you got to add things like that in there whatever nice touch so some showed some range led late charge with big three at two minute mark what well, well can we go as far as to say Wimby led the charge? I mean, Blake Wesley led the charge. Um, but yeah, Wimby, Wimby hit a big shot. He's obviously no 18-year-old LeBron on off. But just so tall and skilled, his tallest questions dominant will and physical enough okay more i watch Wemby, more i believe he's a guard wannabe Th what there's a little man trapped in that gigantic frame likes to bring the ball up go between legs put dribble moves on defenders Defend smaller players on the perimeter. More finesse than force. For now. Skip, what year do you think we're in? Did, did he know that this was the whole draw of Wimbayama to begin with? Is, is he just like... Is he just now getting this information? He thinks he's brilliant. He's like, wow, I just noticed that he's like a guard in a gigantic front. Are we... Have you been paying attention? Also, Wimbayama made some really good um, uh, post moves, big man post moves too. I mean, he he got like he got like two nasty dunks, and he had a really nice um, hook shot. What is he talking about? Like like is this his first time watching Wimbayama play? What does he mean? He likes to go between the legs and put dribble moves on defenders. Is this your first time watching? What is he talking about? more finesse than force for now also also the fact that he's not even paying attention like he's saying he defends smaller players on the perimeter does he think that when Bayama decided that on his own like god god also all of this all of this when when Bayama didn't decide that guys hold on yes yes god dude he just acts like Jeez, let's see. He doesn't know anything. All right, where is it? Here we go. San Antonio's coaches, including Popovich himself, I'm told, gave the number one overall pick one simple mandate, experiment. The coaches want Wimbayama to use his time in summer league to begin to learn what he can and can't do against NBA caliber athletes. That's what was reported. It wasn't Wimbayama's decision to go out there and, and, and do hezzy hez moves, okay? It, it was the San Antonio Spurs. Just like in France before before the playoffs, uh, they wanted him to experiment. It's the same thing. He's trying to see what he can and can't do. God, dude. He just makes it seem like it's all Wimby. Like, ah, oh, Wimby just like, God. So dumb. So dumb. Is that all he had to say? Yeah, I think that's all he had to say. Wait, you guys said something about something he said about Blake and but I don't think he did. Thank God. Wait, I saw Wimby again. It was just one summer league game, but I must admit I wasn't blown away by what I saw from Victor Wimbanyama. He was well taught. He plays the right way. Astonishing skill for his astonishing height but I didn't see Will imposing or obviously physically dominant. God, 
died. Skip just needs to go back 20 years into the NBA. Good God, dude. Just leave it at that. It's just one summer league game. That's all you got to say. It's just a summer league game. But I, God, I didn't know his take was this. I don't know. He's not a Spurs fan, by the way.